guys i don't love tire like these paintings are just a case of what i ordered versus what i got the painting on the right is what biggie placed for them then i don't know what the housemates are doing but one thing i noticed is that Ike was right about Pere. Ike said it, that Pere pretend to be quiet, to come off as intelligent when actually he isn't intelligent. Can you imagine that all these big bodied men trusted um, Pere to lead them in that team and in that tax and he fucked them up. <laughs> hey God, these paintings, this tax is so hilarious. But one thing I know is that I am now seeing Venita in a different light. Venita is actually very smart. And when it comes to tax, she is very hardworking housemate. I hope she makes it this Sunday. I really want to see more of her intelligent, eloquent, smart side. Because come to think of it, guys, it's high time the viewers, the audience, the fans um, stop promoting a housemate with toxic character. People like Venita deserve to go far because she is super intelligent and smart. That is when she is not being a way, way when she's not being, you know, that kind of Venita we saw during the season. But Venita is super articulated. She is an access to anything, anything that she is in. I must tell you, they may win. I don't know, but <laughs> oh my God. Alex was so mad. Like Alex said, I described this thing for you guys very well. In the middle, there is a snail on the ground. And on top of the snail, there is a moon. Go to the edge, there is a tree. And draw a balloon there with a sun. <laughs> I have the center, draw a bicycle. The other side, draw this and draw that. But at the end of the day... The artist that is drawing will draw another thing. I think the success of this kind of tax um, tends to start from the person that describes it and the person that is drawing and hearing whatever that the person is describing. Just imagine, Pere came and just described the object in the, in the canvas, like the object in the portrait. I don't know how to describe it. Without, you know, telling the artist about the background. Just imagine, Venita started by describing the background of the picture before adding the object. And they were doing so well. It's just that their objects are tiny and tiny. Like the balloon looks like spam that is going up in the sky. The tree looks like the tree wants to eat the sun it's so tiny the bicycle is just like a toy i i think if if their picture is a little if the object is a little bit bolder it will come close and resemble that one that biggie gave them as a sample but oh god if you see pere pere just finished his team like if you see how pere is even talking you know that it is his fault that <laughs> his team really messed up and the person that is even describing the whole thing imagine Doni is describing everything from describing without even looking at the painting like or just describing without saying that the moon looks like somebody's head <laughs> it is really really funny when all these things were coming together and um venita had to shed some tears venita went and locked herself in the bedroom in the toilet to cry and people are dragging her i don't understand it, these people are not characters these people are real human beings with emotions and they are allowed to vent they are allowed to show their emotion they are allowed to cry when they want to cry when they have had it up to here many things um little little things trigger some people everybody is not the same thing things may trigger her you don't know and moreover if she's looking for sympathy she could have cried in the face of everybody but she went quietly in the toilet locked herself and was shedding tears trying to let out some uh, tensions and some emotions and people are still coming for her if you think it's pity it's not pity the voting lines are closed so there is nothing it's not pity because there is nothing there no voting again so I think she's just overwhelmed and she needed to 
um, let out some things from her heart. Coming to the painting, the tax and everything, Perez should just admit he's wrong for not mentioning the background first and also the position of the tree. And people that are dragging Perez for being daft just know that some people are gifted in some areas in life. I think if, when it comes to sex, planning evil, plotting against the um, housemates, being smart with conspiracies and alliances, you will give it to Pere. Pere is actually gifted in that side. But when it comes to this kind of thing, no, no, no. Pere is really down in that area.